Did you know what you eat before bed can affect your quality of sleep? And not only that, when you eat may be just as important. Hi, Dr. P back with some tips on how to eat better, to feel better. And in this video and this little mini video series, we're gonna go over exactly what to eat in order to sleep better. So if that sounds good, subscribe so you don't miss the next video. And let's get into today, your best, best sleep inducing snack. We're gonna run through the top two foods and a drink that you can enjoy before bed in order to promote sleep. But also, watch till the end because we know that everyone should be getting seven to nine hours of sleep, right? But what if that is just not you? There are some foods that can help combat sleep deprivation, and they may be just as important to incorporate into your diet so that you can fight off the stress and inflammation that comes from decreased sleep if you just can't sleep the recommended amount every night. What food is up first? That would be kiwi fruit. Yes, kiwi fruit. Two kiwi fruits to be exact, about an hour before bedtime. This was actually found in a study. I'll put the link down in the description so you can check it out if you want. But this is a sleep promoting food. You may be thinking kiwi fruit, why kiwi fruit? Well, a couple theories exist. It is high in serotonin, it is high in folate, it is high in vitamins and antioxidants, but the reality is in this study, they got a grant from the kiwi fruit company. But I mean, I'm all about it. It's better to get a grant from a fruit company than from a drug company, right? Especially if the results were that it promoted sleep. So enjoy your two kiwi fruits before bed. You're going to boost your antioxidants and you're going to help yourself fall asleep and stay asleep. In fact, you may sleep for one hour more if you just consume two kiwi fruits. Second food is pistachio nuts. I talk about nuts all the time on this channel, so if you're going to enjoy your bedtime snack, you're gonna get some kiwi fruits and some pistachios. Pistachios are very high in vitamin B6, and vitamin B6 can help you fall asleep. They also actually help you make melatonin. That sleepy hormone that you get when it gets dark and dusk outside helps you fall asleep. Pistachios can do that. People use pistachios as a treatment for jet lag. You can use them as a solution to get better sleep. In fact, Pistachios are the most melatonin rich food that we have found to date. So if you are looking for exactly what to do, the study really ranges. It could be as low as two pistachios before bed. Two kiwis, two pistachios, we can probably all manage that. But if you're looking for heart healthy nut option anyway, up to a quarter cup, about 20 nuts on average, two kiwis, 20 nuts, I think that is a great bedtime snack, but wait, 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 let's put it all together. What is the best beverage to add to this pre-bed snack? It's probably chamomile tea. Whether you like it hot or cold, brew some fresh chamomile tea and enjoy that with your two kiwi fruit and your two up to 20 pistachio nuts so that you can have one extra hour of sleep every night. And just as promised, what if you are just struggling to get seven to nine hours and you're like, look, nothing I'm gonna do is gonna help me sleep an extra hour. I am at a point in my life where I just need to push through and do the best I can to mitigate this sleep deprivation. Here's what you're going to do. You're going to add foods into your diet that are very high in antioxidants. You need to combat the sleep deprivation loss and all the stress that comes with that for your body. There are some specific foods, cherries and raspberries, really high antioxidant berries. So you could stick with any deep, dark, rich colored berry, raspberry, blackberries, blueberries, even strawberries, but you really, really want a rich colored, high antioxidant food like deep, dark cherries and raspberries. Here's a tip. Get these frozen because they're picked and flash frozen. There are no dyes added. There's no fancy extras. They are just the fruit. They're more affordable that way and they're easy to throw on top of smoothies and oatmeal and yogurt and anything that you might want. You could just defrost them and put them in a, like a little cobbler dish with some oats on the top. Mm, that would be really delicious and would help you combat the stress and sleep deprivation because you're just not able to get seven to nine hours of full sleep. What are you going to avoid to get better sleep? That is foods with food dye in them. So that's why I'm talking about frozen cherries and frozen raspberries. You don't want the cherries like the maraschino cherries in a jar that have added dye. Dye may actually interrupt your pineal gland. That's the gland in your head. It may actually interrupt your pineal gland's ability to make melatonin. So stick with the natural foods as much as possible so that you can get the best sleep possible and if you just can't, you can still feel your best because I know you wanna be the healthiest version of yourself. Thank you for joining me today and I will catch you in a future video.